Hello, my name is Deborah Bisnot and I am a student of Cyril Potter College of Education. Now today, my presentation is based on culturally responsive teaching. Guyana has a multicultural, multi-ethnic identity. The country's various ethnic group has historically contributed to Guyana's diverse culture, one which we must sustain. As a culturally responsive teacher, how can I foster a caring environment and personal connections among students? We are one people. We are one nation. We are one destiny. Together, we are one Guyana. Guyana is made up of six groups of people. We all have different culture, background, and something special in our DNA. What is multicultural? Multicultural is relating to or containing several cultural or ethnic groups within a society. And in our classroom, we have multicultural classroom because our classroom is made up of different types of learners that comes that comes from different ethnic groups, backgrounds, and they are different. Sometimes our learners will want to ask each other, how are you different or tell me about your ethnic group. So as educators, we must be able to teach our learners how can I foster a caring environment and personal connection among my learners? Now, I can do that by having some community involvement. This is where I can have involvement with parents, grandparents, community members, persons who can come and share their stories and give some histories of their ethnicity, the groups and so on from years ago so that our young generation can listen and learn from them. Also, there in my introduction video when I displayed all the ethnic groups and some contributions and their music, I can display videos to my learners in the classroom, get them excited, get them to know the type of music and the type of food and the clothing that they wear. So in their community or when they, when they visit or go places and they see the different cultures, they can be familiar and they can know about the culture or they can say, okay, now this here, this is an African song and this is a, this is a Amerindian dish. They can be familiar with the different cultures. That is where I do my displaying. Next, I can have a good classroom setup, an ethnic group classroom setup. Now, I can create a corner. I can have actual things in my corner for the ethnic groups. So children can come, they can look at them, touch them, feel them physically and see the, the ethnic group clothing and so on and that will encourage them to look around their environment and their country and know about the ethnic groups then i can have i can form relationships with my learners and their parents i can ask them let's interact and talk and discuss about the ethnic groups and their cultures 
I can even make a game. I can make a game with the different ethnic groups. And this makes it excited for the learners to come and play the game and guess guess what contribution is made to that specific ethnic groups. I can also incorporate some popular culture that is by having a mo- movie. There I listed some culturally responsive instructional strategies that I can use in my classroom to help my learners to know that we are one people, one nation, one destiny.